The Eiffel Tower is so famous that it has become not only a symbol of Paris, but the whole of France. It never fails to impress, especially when its 20,000 light bulbs are illuminated. But did you know that it is actually illegal to take pictures of the tower at night? This epic monument consistently attracts more than 6.9 million visitors from across the globe who come to see the tower and take photos each year. You will find its image in countless guidebooks, online articles, and breathtaking Instagram snaps. However, what you probably don't realize is that media outlets rarely release photos of the tower at night. Taking a photograph of the Eiffel Tower at night could result in you breaking the law. Thanks to the iconic light show, which illuminates the attraction in the evening, it is actually illegal to take pictures of the tourist attraction after dark. Take a photo during daytime and no one cares, but problem arises after evening when the Eiffel Tower lights are switched on. It turns out that sharing your own pictures of the iconic structure at nighttime is a copyright violation if it's used for commercial purpose. Gustav Eiffel held the copyright for the tower and he died in 1923, meaning that the copyright ran out 70 years later in 1993. At this point, the likeliness and the design of the tower were allowed to enter the public domain. Hence why you could find a replica of the Eiffel Tower built in 1999 in Las Vegas. Freedom of Panorama allows photographers to capture buildings, artworks, sculptures, paintings or monuments in public spaces, even when they are still under copyright. Since 7th October 2016, limited freedom of panorama for works of architecture and sculpture has been in place in France. French law now authorizes reproductions and representations of work of architecture and sculpture placed permanently in public places and created by natural persons with the exception of any usage of commercial character. This law means that the tourists are allowed to take photos and videos of copyrighted buildings for personal use, as long as there is no commercial benefit attached. According to SETE, which manages the tower, the lights on it are an artistic work. Eiffel Tower website states, the various illuminations of the Eiffel Tower, it could be the golden illumination, twinkling, beacon, and even lighting where all of them are protected. The image usage of the Eiffel Tower at night is therefore subjected to prior authorization by the SETE. This use is subjected to payment of the rights, the amount of which is determined by the intent of use, the media plan, etc. This means that anyone who wants to photograph it after dark must get permission from them. European copyright law says that it is illegal to distribute pictures of copyrighted works. According to Snopes, pictures posted on social media can also count as distribution, which is where holiday makers could get in trouble. The French courts have never ruled on this though, so it is possible that you would never be successfully sued if it came to the crunch. Under European law, Copyright expires 70 years after the death of the creator. The lights were installed in 1985, where the installer remains alive today, meaning the copyright will be in place for decades to come. Anyone taking a picture from top of the tower is totally fine, though a message on the website reads, the views from the Eiffel Tower are rights free. So be cautious while uploading or using the nighttime photos of the Eiffel Tower for commercial purpose. If you like this video, hit the like button and share it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Click the bell icon for notifications. Thanks for watching this video. See you till next time.